The launch had been months in the making. A group of people have been speaking to Marlene Hassan Naon about their frustrations with local politics for some months now. Today, in their new premises on Main Street, some of them were introduced via video. I am joining together Gibraltar because I am a proud Gibraltarian and I feel it is important to have a place where we can air our views and share our opinions. I'm joining together Gibraltar because I believe there's a better way for us to care and provide for our communities while also seeing Gibraltar prosper. I will continue to work for all my constituents. The independent MP describes Together Gibraltar as a civic platform designed to allow citizens to make their voices heard. Do you go into this fully expecting it to progress into a party that contests the next general election? We're not looking at forming any party. We're looking at um, engaging with society, learn from what people have to say and uh, people's views, needs, expectations and issues. If that ever materialised into a collective of people that might want to continue to, an, to another election, to, an, to a campaign as a party, that would be a matter for the time if and when it comes. But you are open then to the possibility of building a team to contest the next election? At the moment we're, we're just about uh, engaging with the public and understanding what people are, are needing and wanting in Gibraltar at the moment in order to get a much better idea of what agenda would be put in a political project if it ever came and if not to continue as a lobby or as an NGO, as a think tank. What's the inspiration for Together Gibraltar? Are you looking at Podemos in Spain, Macron in France? Well, we've seen um, many movements in the last couple of years, like the ones that you've just mentioned, um, who have done very well, actually, and turned into political parties out of, um, out of starting as a movement. But there's a reason for that. It's because they started off with the right um, sense of duty, which is listening to people and understanding their agendas rather than imposing their own agendas on people. I continue to be an independent member of parliament which means that I shadow any or all issues or constituents that want to come to me and engage with me and, f and have some representation in parliament. Ms Hassan Naon and her activists believe there is a gap in local politics owing to partisan clashes and the resulting polarisation of views. Together, Gibraltar says it hopes to appeal to a section of the community who do not feel represented at the moment. Their first public meeting will be in November to discuss the environment.